there you are. Hey. I feel like we haven't seen each other in forever. You want to have some dinner later? I'd love to, but, you know, yoga waits for no one. Another time. <sighs> oh, hey, there you are. I was cracking. So, we all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <coughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file. What is wrong with you? Davy! Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked! Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. Gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Nothing. Really. The criminals are believed to have escaped with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey. rings. Albert Story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, hey, you gotta move these bikes. I don't know anything about that. And this other guy runs out of the shop, he pushes me over and says something like, you forget thousands of things every day. You make sure this is one of them. That was pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but that don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you've done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor! I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Oh, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's, let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, hmm? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh, I don't mean nothing by it, man. I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug. Yeah. Shh. <laughs> fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you, then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> Cowboys forced our hand. We gotta find the rest of the lost. Wait! This ghost I saw. His name is Michael Townley. Sounds like he's living in Los Santos. Find him. Really? Uh my cousin fair, but I don't find him! Wait! You just mean I don't have to come see the bikers? We're in a hurry, but not that much of a hurry. But if we bury Johnny in the desert, and then quiet down that bitch Ashley he was in, then they don't need to find out about it! You think it's clever to disrespect women? Disrespect? What? I, I wasn't disrespecting, I was just saying we should kill her! You called her a bitch! Ain't you got a mother? Everyone got muggers, at least one.
We're going up to that farm on the right? That's where they're meant to be. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, you seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you mess him with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry, what was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient party you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Oh, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. If that van takes us back to the camp, this area ain't gonna have a biker problem much longer. The van's got a pass, but the guys on bikes can go. You got him! There's the other one! You didn't see that coming. Okay, now we follow the van back. Did you see the look on their faces? We scared them, didn't we? Yeah, thank fuck they didn't make you for the harmless idiots you are. You need some feet belt back here, or straps or something. I only keep things in the back, I don't mind losing. Oh. Sharp left! Slow it down! Uh, I can't see us taking out all the bikers this go, boss. I mean, there'll be some by that airstrip, and some over, you know, by that... If not today... Their time will soon be upon them. If we go off the side on the left there, we should make it across. Sure. Once you know, you could drop me and Wade at the trailer. Maybe bring Chef to finish them. We do this now, Ron, all of us. Where are we headed? I gotta take third by good blood. I'll make my own lost MC colors out of this brick's leather. Lead us back. Oh, look, look, they're pulling up. You did it, Trevor. They're stopping. Hold the perimeter, fuckwits. Daddy's going to work.
Still doing here? You said I said go find a fucking ghost in Los Santos. All right, you looking for motivation? Oh yeah, pick me up some sticky bombs. We're dropping in on Ortega. He has Tekas? That makes me nervous. Ah, don't be nervous, nervous Ron. He'll be fine with the takeover. Takeover, Trevor. We don't need to. Now the bikers are gone. It's just us. He has Tekas and the O'Neills. The market's big enough. This Chinese contact's gonna buy crystal fast as we can cook it. We just gotta meet him at the end, and... Yeah, 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 Soggy friend, you are out of business. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. Saying something don't make it true. I always let you operate. I didn't have to. You have been told. Oh, that feels better. You sure mean business, T. talking about. Look at me. I'm cranked on speed most of the time, but I'm productivity personified. You sure achieved a lot today. It was time to put my affairs in order. You going somewhere? As soon as I find that specter on the TV, Michael Townley. He's your buddy you said got shot, right? You guys used to run together. Yeah, that's him. My best pal. I thought he was dead. You're catching on fast. Yeah. The fucking ghost I've been talking about! He's alive? 
He's walking, and he's talking, and he's sticking up joints, so I guess, yeah, that makes him alive, don't it? And how you know it's him? It's his M.O., and it's the same corny shit he was spewing ten years back. This could be a trap, Trevor. What if someone wants you to think he's alive? I was fooled when I thought he was dead. I ain't fooled now. Michael Townley lives and breathes. He's in Los Santos, and he's got some explaining to do. They could be trying to draw you out into the open. That's a conspiracy theory too far, even for you, Ronald. Really? Well, anyway, it seems like a shame for you to be going, just as TP Industries is finding its feet. Get out of the car, Ron. Any time to think. Run! Speak! You know I don't like using these things. They're listening. Then make it quick. That business thing's been set up. The Chinese guy, Mr. Chang, is at the inn. You said that on the phone? What the fuck is wrong with you, damn it, Ron? Now I'm gonna have to discipline you and you know how I feel about that. 